Okay, let's continue on. So let's go ahead and build our um, upper joint here. So let's go in here, and I'm going to build, get a new mesh, and I'm going to build a cylinder. Like so. We'll make it 375 by 375 millimeters. And we'll draw it out. Like so. We'll bring it over to line it up. Okay, that's looking pretty good. Let's make it a little less wide here. Okay, now I'm going to grab both ends, bevel, and I'm going to pull this out like so. I'm going to shift click, pull it out again, scale it in, shift click, scale it in some more, and pull it down in the X, shift click, and pull it on back. Now as you can see we have our side joint there. So let's go in here and hide this so I can build my wood to connect it. So let's grab another cube. Let's go in here, make it about this big. We'll pull it out like so. Okay, that's looking pretty good there. Let's go ahead and duplicate it and bring the other one over. Now we got two, so let's go ahead and loop slice these. So, just to make these stick. Now, we have our two little rungs coming out there. Let's unhide our geometry. Now, let's go in here and grab our edges. And let's scale them out from each other a little bit, like so. Now let's grab these middle polygons, X to extrude them, R to scale in, and let's scale it in like that. Now let's adjust this, like so. I want to put these right in the middle, which that looks pretty good there. Okay, so now let me go ahead and loop slice these. So everything is good and short up. Now we just got to do the inside here. And the inside on the other side. And we sub D that. That looks pretty good. And we have our joints in there. So now let's go ahead and grab these polygons, extrude them out, like so. Let's scale them. I'm going to scale mine on the Z to make them flat. And let's take this back a tad. So, and let's scale it out, make it a little wider. We'll scale it out like that. Okay, now if we need to do anything else, we can always extrude it some more. Let's run a loop slice right down through here. Let's count of just one. I'll put it right close to the edge. And that'll help hold that. 
Okay. Okay. So there we go. There's our leg joint now. I guess we could make this just a tad smaller. Like so. Now we have our pelvis joint. Next, we're going to build our joint here. Okay? And after we build our joint, we'll mirror it over. Thanks for watching, guys.